In this video, we prove the adjoint triangle theorem. To do this, recall the following. One, the Oneida embedding Y on a category preserves limits and is full and faithful. Two, let FG be an adjoint situation. For each A object A, epsilon A is a regular epimorphism if and only if epsilon A is equal to the co-equalizer of epsilon FGA, FG epsilon A. Three, a functor R is a joint if and only if for each A object A, the presheaf A, A R is representable. We start with the definition. A parallel pair F G is a reflexive pair if and only if there exists a morphism S such that F S is equal to the identity on B, which is equal to G S. In other words, S is a common section for F and G. Note that for an adjoint situation F G with co-unit epsilon, epsilon FGA, FG epsilon A is a reflexive pair by the triangle identities for the adjoint situation. And so we see that F eta GA is a common section for these parallel pair of morphisms. Then the adjoint triangle theorem is as follows. Consider the following triangle where we have adjoint situations FG and HGR. Then if the category B has co-equalizers of reflexive pairs, and if epsilon A is a regular epimorphism for each A object A, then R is an adjoint functor. For the proof, by three above, it is enough to show that for each A object A, the presheaf A, A, R is representable. By two above, we have epsilon A as the co-equalizer of epsilon F, G, A, F, G, epsilon A. By one above, since the Oneida embedding preserves limits, it takes this co-equalizer in A to the following equalizer in set, which is natural in X. Then using the adjoint situation FG, we have the following isomorphic parallel pair of morphisms. And then by the adjoint situation HGR, we arrive at the following isomorphism of parallel pairs in the category of sets. And noting again that everything is natural in X. Therefore, there exists this unique parallel pair of representable presheaves. And thus, since the Oneida embedding is full and faithful, there exists a unique parallel pair of amorphisms from HGFGA to HGA. Then since epsilon FGA, FG epsilon A is a reflexive pair in A, each one of the parallel pairs on the right is a co-reflexive pair of set morphisms, which is the dual concept of a reflexive pair. Therefore, by invoking the Oneida embedding again, we see that the blue parallel pair is a reflexive pair of amorphisms. Then by the assumption that the category B has co-equalizers of reflexive pairs, there exists an object B in the category B, which is a co-equalizer of the, of the blue parallel pair FG. Therefore, since the Oneida embedding preserves limits, we have YB on X, which by definition is the HOM set BBX, is equal to the equalizer of the purple pair on the right. And since the HOM set A, A, R, X is equalizer of the top pair, it is also the equalizer of the purple pair since limits are defined up to isomorphism. Therefore, we see that the presheaf A, A, R is isomorphic to the representable presheaf on the object B, which is what we wanted to show. Therefore, R is a joint, which completes the proof.